Some models leave an indelible mark on our hearts, either for outstanding driving performance or reliability. In the list of unforgettable, you can safely take a place in Lancer of the ninth generation, the durability and unpretentiousness of which are legendary. Connoisseurs will surely notice that the body of the Mitsubishi Lancer is not strong enough. And they will be partly right. Japanese subcompact models have never been durable. However, a well-built welding technology and strengthening of the body frame at the production stage make it possible to forget about this problem during operation. At least until the first crash. However, the restoration of the machine is usually not so expensive. The rest of the Lancer is what you need. Not without reason, after the end of its assembly in some countries, the car was again put on the conveyor, and for almost two years it was sold in parallel with the 10th generation. In our secondary market, there are mainly sedans and station wagons, which were once bought new from dealers. Only rarely are imported specimens found. Imported versions differ from the Ukrainian ones in orange turn signals and square stampings for the license plate. And under the hoods of such Lancers, as a rule, petrol 2-liter GDI engines are paired with a machine gun. In the engine range of Ukrainian versions, power units with a volume of 1.3 liters, 82 horsepower, 1.6 liters, 98 horsepower, and 2.0 liters, 135 horsepower. The standard transmission is a 5-speed mechanics. For all engines, except for the 1.3 liter, a 4-band automatic was offered. Mitsubishi Lancer is surprisingly spacious. However, it is difficult for tall drivers to find the optimal driving position due to the lack of reach adjustment and insufficient movement of the seat back. Thanks to a decent wheelbase, 2600 mm, the rear is so free that even the three of us will be comfortable. There is enough space both above the head and in the knees. The back of the rear sofa folds down, but there is no inner handle on the trunk lid, hands get dirty when closing. The cargo compartment is small, only 420 liters but a full-size spare wheel is hidden under the floor. Another big plus of Mitsubishi Lancer is generous equipment. Dealers sold a post-styling car, younger than 2005, in three performance levels. The basic version was equipped with ABS, air conditioning, frontal airbags, electric mirrors and side windows. Modification with a 1.6-liter engine additionally had heated front seats. The next performance included fog lights, climate control instead of air conditioning and side airbags. The steering wheel was sheathed in genuine leather. The top version has alloy wheels, door sills and Momo steering wheel. The same version with a 2.0-liter engine was equipped with a stiffer suspension, 16-inch wheels and a trunk spoiler. Buying a used Lancer will only be justified if you get the car in relatively good condition. Therefore, the key point before the deal is diagnostics. There are few congenital diseases in the car. The paintwork should be protected from mechanical damage. Experts advise choosing a used Lancer in metallic color, which will more reliably protect the body from corrosion. In frosts, the reflective elements of the side mirror sometimes burst. They were usually replaced under warranty. However, even a new part can become unusable. The most popular of the three engines is the 1.6 liter. It is high torque and economical, easily reaches maximum speed and pulls well on the bottoms. Structurally, the engines are similar, the 2 liter has two camshafts instead of one. Spark plugs serve 30,000 to 50,000 kilometers, but if there are interruptions in their work, it is better not to delay the replacement so as not to lose the catalyst. For prevention, after 45,000 kilometers it is recommended to flush the throttle body and injection systems. Accessory drive belts change according to condition. After 90,000 kilometers, the timing belt with rollers is updated, and it is also advisable to flush the injectors. The radiator leak was eliminated after restyling in 2005 by installing a protective bandage on it, which protects the radiator tank from salt and chemicals. And the radiator itself has changed in design. The replacement of the fuel filter in the tank is provided for at 120,000 km. Since it comes with part of the fuel pump, the amount is no small amount. After 3 to 4 years, the exhaust corrugation burns out. The transmission is generally hassle-free. A Japanese-made mechanical box was installed on the Lancer. Do not forget to change the oil every 120,000 km. The clutch serves an average of 150,000 km. In the machine, an oil change is provided after 90,000 km. The automatic transmission resource is at least 250,000 km, however, under the condition of normal operation, fully independent suspension is also hassle-free. On early versions, the chassis could creak due to dirt accumulating on the lower coils of the springs. On cars younger than 2005, this is no longer the case. Chassis elements serve more than 100,000 kilometers, 
and some even 150,000. Before the deadline, the front stabilizer struts and rear suspension wishbones sometimes burst. From salt and dirt, the bolts for adjusting the toe and camber angles turn sour. Brake calipers are best cleaned and lubricated at every mow, then they will almost never jam. But the steering rack is durable, its resource is exhausted closer to 250,000 km. The 1.6-liter engine is reliable and hassle-free. With high quality and timely maintenance, its motor resource is 350,000 km. The unit works fine on 90-second gasoline, however, this does not mean that it can be a surrogate. It has practically no weak points, except for those that appear due to wear of engine parts. The transmission is not of particular interest to repairmen. On a mechanical box, as a rule, after 200,000 km, the linkage of the lever may become loose. The key to the longevity of the machine is in the periodic, every 120,000 km, oil change. There are almost no problem areas in the front suspension. Stabilizer struts and bushings nurse up to 90,000 km. Shock absorbers with thrust bearings and hub bearings withstand 120,000 km. Ball bearings assembled with levers and silent blocks cost up to 150,000 km. The rear suspension will remind of itself only by 100,000 km, when the stabilizer bushings wear out. The transverse and trailing arms and wheel bearings last one and a half times longer. The body is well protected from corrosion, but the paintwork is weak. There are problems with body parts. For example, in winter, the reflective elements of the side mirrors burst. Over time, the larva of the trunk lock becomes clogged and sour, if it is opened only from the passenger compartment. In this case, disassembly and cleaning usually help. The electrical equipment works well, although over time, indicators in the seat heating switches burn out, which are not supplied separately. Occasionally, the warmers themselves fail in the seat cushions. 